Hello everyone. So in today's session, we are going to learn about serial communication. That is how our Arduino will communicate with the computer. So for that, we have an interest, uh, interesting feature in our Arduino. That is a serial communication. So first of all, what we have to do, we have to turn on the serial communication. For that, we have a command like uh, serial communicate uh, serial dot begin to turn on the serial communication. Now it will take a number or your baud rate. So if you see on my uh, right hand side, you can see that we have a uh, box. So if you want to open this box, just click on this area that is here you can see serial monitor or what you can do, you can go to the tool option and in the tool section, you can see we have serial monitor and the shortcut is control shift tab and on the serial plotter, you can see we have control uh, shift L so you can use any one of them. Now, apart from that, in your this uh, serial monitor, you can see on the top, we have the COM port, which is my 29. Below that, you have auto scroll option. And after that, you have this end line. So uh, we will talk about it later on. So the important thing is this uh, 9600. This we called as a uh, your baud rate. Now, if you click on this, you can see that we have several types of baud rate which are available. So like this is this is the frequency band by which your Arduino and your computer will communicate. By default, it is uh, 9600. Let's uh, let it be that. Now we have to write here the baud rate which we are using. So we are using 9600. So here we have written. Now for example, let's say first we want to let's say just print. So for printing anything, we will write your serial dot print serial dot print uh, the remember you have to remember that the s is capital serial dot print now let's say i want to print uh, let's say hello world so as it is a string so it should be done in double quotes i closed it let's say run the code okay here, here you can see we have written like this hello world which is like showing and going so it is like uh, because we, we have turned on the auto scroll if i turn on the auto scroll you can see hello world and then it is here you can see in the bottom it is scrolling so like it is in the for loop that's why it is like repeating itself again and again now what i want to do i want to print hello world then it should be print in a new line so what we can do for uh, adding a new line i can use ln ln for your new line so let's upload the code okay. so in my uh, serial monitor you can see we can see hello world over there and now this is not like in a single vertical arrangement it is like oh, it is not a horizontally it is like in vertical arrangement so this is your serial communication now let's say instead of this uh, hello world what do we want to do we want to like add something more so we can also try to do that let's say control c and you can use it as many time as we want in our uh, setup let's say at the start i want to print something so serial dot print I upload it here you can see now if I turn off the auto scroll you will see at the top the first one is uh, this uh, my first step in CL communication here you can see. now there is one strange thing uh, that you should know that is for example if I change the baud rate let's say I want to use this one so here you can see instead of ln we have written it is showing in a horizontal arrangement and it is also this box like structure so it is like not understanding what we are uh, saying so if uh, we are uh, want to communicate with the computer so we have to be honest the song uh, same baud rate 
So let's say I want to use this one 19200. So I have to change it from here 19200 and let's say I upload it. After uploading, you will see that it is working perfectly fine. Here you can see. So that is the previous one. Okay, here you can see. Hello world. And it is like increasing. You can see in the scroll. If I turn it on, here you can see. So this is all about your serial communication.